But we're starting off with developing news out of Hampshire County. Welcome to Western Mass News on ABC 40. I'm Glenn Kittle. A multi-million dollar federal lawsuit was filed today against the Amherst Pelham Regional Public Schools and some former and present administration staff. The lawsuit filed by one of the district's special education teachers and former union leader. Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey joins us in studio with more. Olivia. Glenn Lamico McGee, who currently serves as the Dean of Students at Amherst Regional Middle School, filed the lawsuit. According to her attorney, this came after experiencing defamation and retaliation for advocating for marginalized students that experienced discrimination in the district, filing complaints and questioning unfair labor practices. The 27-page lawsuit outlines events from October 2022 to November 2023 in which McGee filed complaints and claims she received retaliation from the district, including allegedly being terminated in August of 2023 without prior warning and reinstatement shortly after. Another claim states she was placed in the role of Dean of Students in September 2023, but was allegedly denied the promotion to administrator. As for defamation, the lawsuit outlines one incident in which a former district official allegedly distributed flyers to attendees of an emergency school committee meeting in May of last year. The suit claims the flyers contained false and def defamatory information about McGee and two other district employees. McGee's attorney shares a statement that reads, defaming educators who courageously advocate for marginalized students is not only immoral, it is illegal. This lawsuit was filed to hold accountable those who attempt to silence our educators with defamation and other retaliatory tactics. We will fight relentlessly until justice prevails. According to the lawsuit, McGee is on medical leave under treatment to manage trauma caused by the defendants. Now, Western Mass News has reached out to the district's interim superintendent and the district school committee for comment. We have yet to hear back. Reporting in the studio, Olivia Hickey, Western Mass News. 